हाय हेलो ऑल हेलो माय नेम इज़ मृदुला रवि किरण एंड आई आई वेलकम यू ऑल फॉर दिस लाइव सेशन इंस्टाग्राम सेशन इट्स कॉल्ड द टॉक ऑन आर्ट सो बेसिकली द इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ क्रिएटिंग दिस पेज and um, uh, creating a channel called muse arts is to uh, know about the insights of the artist life uh, when i say uh, insights uh, i mean uh, certain things that apart from the theoretical and practical uh, uh, learnings what we uh, come across apart from that uh, what i mean by saying that is um, you know uh, overcoming stage fear or um, uh, you know uh, the inspiration maintaining the balance uh, between passion and studies and passion and career so uh, we try to focus on certain things that uh, has a lot of impact on um, uh, an artist life so um, today i welcome uh, my guru uh, shrimati shubha dananjay uh, she is a renowned bharatanatyam and kathak dancer Uh, she's been a dancer choreographer guru performer organizer for almost more than 25 years now so i can see rakshita hi leena hi manu hi so i can see a lot of people coming in so i welcome you all once again and uh, i hope everybody are safe and having a good time with your family and staying safe so uh, i'll see if uh, ma'am is there uh can join me right now so all right so and um we are going to discuss today on the facts that are going through uh, uh you know in every artist life today uh, in the lockdown period so uh, being digital is become has become more influential now and yes it is a great platform because we can see uh, so many hidden talents uh, because of the uh, you know performance whatever uh, uh, is been posted online so there are uh, we can reach up to thousands to million of people uh, at the art lovers um, within a fraction of few seconds so that's the power of digital so um, uh, uh, yes uh, ma'am is here yes and uh, firstly namaste ma'am can you hear me namaste namaste i am on talk yes 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 ma'am very much with me so uh, firstly i would like to welcome you uh, to this live uh, instagram session so i'm very happy that uh, you uh, motivated me to do this <laughs> and uh, you are agreed you within fraction of seconds you agreed <laughs> so i'm very happy to uh, be talking with you and i would like to congratulate for the fact that you have uh, done something wonderful uh, something that nobody could even imagine uh, in the lockdown period that is uh, training uh, you know your uh, well uh, trained disciple uh, you know training her motivating her inspiring her to uh, you know uh, uh, performing her ranga pravesha of your disciple kumari leena suresh at this uh, lockdown time that is a wonderful achievement and uh, i think that is some uh, nobody can even think about something like that so i congratulate you for that <laughs> so it's definitely thank an inspiration you, for you, us thank you thank you thank you so no like it's new it's no like it's new i'm very really happy i'm very really happy to press it to prince could inspire one of could inspire one of the student to do her uh, ranga prasha her uh, ranga prasha and uh, she and uh, she is family is also family is also family yeah. everybody uh, everybody is uh, nice yes ma'am so and uh, today uh, uh, the uh, lock, because of the lockdown period i see lot of online performances where uh, it's an inspiration uh, for an artist to actually reach thousands and millions of uh, art lovers within seconds so it is a great platform uh, can you uh, uh, tell us something about that what an artist feel please give me the comment if the audio is fine now please let me know in the comments and if you have any queries please do post it on the comment section we'll try to address it uh, as and when possible um, yeah yes okay 
I am. Yes. <laughs> Sorry for the interruption. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I think it should be. Now? Yes, yes. Am I online? <laughs> Sorry, sorry for the interruptions. Okay. okay. Yes, ma'am. Please tell me. Yeah. That's fine. And yes. Yeah. Okay. So I don't know how much audible I was as I spoke uh, before. I was just uh, mentioning that yes, whatever we you watch any videos, any quality videos of quality dancing, quality art, music, dance, it should. really inspire you inspire you to look into yourself look at yourself and see where you can improve and how how much involved you can become in your own art be it dance or music but if something especially in this lockdown period is bothering you is causing you you more pain seeing that everybody are doing something so many people are coming with their videos oh that's happening they she is doing that there something is happening and how come i'm not doing anything no the first thing is that you need to stop that whining and if you really feel that you want to do start with something very small as small as a small uh, bit which you really like which you're very passionate about which you really feel that you should look at yourself performing that maybe a small jati a small jati which you learned in your jati swara a small uh, bit of abhinaya which you had always liked just start with that and then if you feel convinced yes uh, i love looking at, at this video prepare it so and the other thing is it's not very um, crucial for you to do that this time this time of this lockdown period this time where you are feeling like you have more time than usual than normal because most of the time you would have uh, in invested your time in uh, mm-hmm. traveling to your college or your workplace anything so especially when you are at home you would have got that extra amount of time which you will have to really make up your mind and really plan and to do to do what you think is best for you and um, about the thing is like especially being artists who perform on stage theater artists we are a different kind of species altogether mm. i would like to put it that way because uh, since my childhood uh, i already mentioned that i would like to perform with full audience with audience filled with scholars and elders and artists or any common audience the in, in general audience but still i would always love to have audience in front of me that means i was not, never comfortable dancing in front of a camera so maybe i never liked to go to do the session for the show until and I, unless i was invited i would never uh, go to any tv channel or do the session and every time i went i used to feel a little different this is the main difference dear artists dear friends dear children please please note this very seriously this is the difference between an actor and yes. an actor yes definitely yes. the actor yes the actor feels very comfortable especially a successful actor or an actress becomes successful because he or she is more comfortable acting playing a character or a role in mm-hmm. front of a camera and uh, they would not expect immediate reaction from from the audience because they don't have audience because they need to uh, keep silence until and unless it's performed and the results are out out way much yes. later much later may take a week months years together and they enjoy it so they enjoy the results uh, very later and uh, i don't know i could i could never uh, adhere to this kind of principles in life and so i think uh, we all artists are alike 
and this kind of social media is putting us into kind of confusion uh because uh, sometimes we need to become yes, actors yes. and actresses because again the same thing we we try to do our own small video and we are not yes. happy because uh, when we uh-huh. see when we compare it with big yeah. budget films they have the best sophisticated yeah. cameras and there are spot boys there is a lighting man and there are yes, geniuses around. to make one scene come alive and uh, to make it look very beautiful and very impactful and if we think we are trying to do that i think we are most uh, we are uh, most of the time wrong so it's there where only art takes the upper seat our art art and just our hard work and sincere efforts being real artists so just to perform a few minutes on stage or in front of the camera we artists who have yes. slogged the whole yes. of our childhood our memories the growing up uh, memories are always associated with a practice and um, lots of uh, uh, hard work i don't know i i have never thought it's hard work because i grew up enjoying all my practice and even if i was sweating from morning till night with my dance practices that i thought it was my life okay during this uh, lockdown time there are uh, uh, every artist is actually missing the practice sessions so how to maintain that kind of uh, you know motivation to self motivation to continue and to work out every day and then uh, self motivate ourselves to uh, you know continue with the practice okay i think you asked me the question and also answered it yourself <laughs> so how to keep up the practice self motivation and um, yeah it is self motivation and nothing else uh maybe yeah it happened with me also uh, first few days almost uh, more than a week i was very happy i thought uh, yes anyway i got this weeks time and let me just rest anyway there is no class i need not go to my classes and i need not uh, there were many uh, small uh, nearing dates getting cancelled so anyway i was uncertain whether the performance is happening so the moment the lockdown was officially announced i thought anyway it's uh, postponed and uh, we need not practice i need not um, bother about any practice or even maybe my us tour or foreign tours the other travels are all uh, cancelled let me just rest i think this happened with all the artists who were really very busy and uh, trying to take some time off of their uh, regular schedule but later when you when you definitely know that this is not permanent this is not going according to what you really are supposed to do or what you are it's not natural then you need to get out of your comfort zone and i think for wasting a few days or more than a week you need to practice stuff so just yes. uh whether it's the regular place where you used to practice to go when you like go to the class and practice along with your other friends in front of your guru or anything you will have to uh, recreate all that atmosphere around you and work doggy hard only that way you will be more happy that you utilize utilized um, this period of uh, rest or that lockdown and that gives you more energy more spirit to really work hard and to introspect yourselves and uh, this is one very uh, best time for to look back and see if you have really worked hard if you have done yes. everything correct yes any wrong decisions taken or did you make any mistakes in your past so this is the right time to correct it and uh, go in the right path because there is no stopping you there is no other thing and uh, you have more time or more what do you say like um, you can really 
think like what is to be done actually what is it that you're looking for and then just start concentrating on that and that's the best thing best approach for you to practice harder and i don't want to use this uh, word harder because um, practice more and uh, be more happier because when i feel like somebody says yeah did you work very hard i always thought no and i don't think it was hard because uh, this is what i liked and have done and uh, you feel uh, bad that you didn't get many many hours this is a normal uh, question especially in the beginning i used to feel very embarrassed really to be very honest i used to be really uh, feel very embarrassed because like anybody wanted to felicitate me or uh, honor me or to present some award to me i used to feel i didn't do anything because i don't know anything else i have grown up loving dance i have grown up dancing and uh, i have been lucky enough i have been uh, blessed by some of the great gurus and gods to be in this beautiful field of dance so when i'm just doing what i like why should somebody say that yeah you did something great that was not great because it, it's a way of life for me so this is what i used to feel and then i got used to okay somebody is liking me liking me to go on the stage and to and i just took it uh, as it came thinking that's all the blessings of god and this is how for my life continued and uh, here i would like to mention my one more thing uh if you think you saw many videos if you think uh you feel that many dancers many artists are very really popular popular famous or they got more recognition than they uh actually uh, deserved think of much more artists who have not received any such honors and uh, it gives me a lot of pain to say i have always noticed that more uh, artists like who have really laid down their lives or uh, they have just committed to this uh, art or dedicated their whole life for this art form they were never recognized sometimes mm-hmm. it's so pathetic as uh, like i was in the com- committee to select some artists for the state's uh, highest award when we went, went through some biodatas or when we went through the names of artists the senior gurus who have uh, really done a great job they were just leading a life such simplicity and such uh, unnoticed way of life because just because they didn't they were not recognized they didn't have a social name the students mm-hmm. who learned from them they would have gone in search of some uh, other teacher who had more popularity or a bigger name just to put in their biodata to say just that their student or their disciple that's the most pathetic um thing that any uh, dance student can do because the main art the main the discipline of art would have definitely come from the original guru who held the child's uh, finger little finger and guided through the arduous and all the markers and made that child an artist to be recognized after the yes. recognition recognition suddenly the student thinks yeah and a born artist and i don't know what this guru did to me and they just start running and i think this is a all time problem which i just thought i should mention because uh, you'll have to really think of many gurus many senior artists and uh, those days where there were not many uh, photographs or videos to at least record their work they have gone unnoticed but they have given us so much so that we continue in this field and uh, contribute whatever 
possible from our side so i think uh, so i think no matter if, if there is a media influence or social platform influence i think we have to be true to our art uh, be true to our art form and be true to our guru i think that is the uh, basic things that any artist i think are following there are artists who are really following that and i think that is uh, that will really uh, carry them a long way take them a long way Absolutely. so uh, yes, yes. absolutely and i yeah and i think uh, this is the best time to invest in uh, uh, ourselves to improve our, ourselves i think this is the best time to invest on the knowledge what we have got and to learn so i think that is very the true. best to, think, to do now yeah and yes. you have time to watch others videos please yes. go on it's <laughs> not that you should not watch yes. but take the inspiration and recognize yourself recognize your mm-hmm. potential recognize your art form the strength in yourself and then start working with your own art this is what i have got to say because um, these days like after this i started putting some posts saying that this is the first time i'm uh, sharing with you one of the a full video of one of my mm-hmm. um, performance or even i am doing some quarantine my video of my mm-hmm. along with my students and all that yeah we are d- uh, truly enjoying it's not that uh, we have to copy i think everybody has got to say the same thing as long as you enjoy what you are doing keep yes. enjoying but yes. just to do something immediately for a quick mean or quick yes uh, pay the urge to get uh, quick popularity don't do something so silly that uh, really you would not like to see yourself in that so the yes. moment if uh, you feel that yes it's beautiful i would love to share yes that's the positivity a positivity that you carry along and also you can share it with on the on the onlookers and your friends and also inspire other friends of yours yes i think these live performances what artists have been doing i think we can learn a lot from them as well as uh, you know so many artists who who were uh, hidden talents i think we can uh, get to know so many artists who have uh, been very talented till now and uh, they have never come online i think we can have we have to learn much about uh, i mean about them and uh, from them i really? think that is the best thing to do yes <laughs> yes showcase the talent i would say <laughs> So. yeah it's it's very uh, very personal very unique and very very different to each of uh, the artists like what they would like to express so you use both the words like to express not to impress so definitely uh, it takes a kind of challenge to decide like uh, what's uh, in between these two words because if they really want to express themselves there are many ways and uh, it's not uh, really it's essentially uh, needed that they really need to upload their videos until they are ready with something but just to get it ready do not jump into conclusions or do, do not dump, jump into depression or disappointment or anything so that is uh, definitely a no uh, and yeah. uh, keep yourself happy that happiness comes from within when you know truly that you have done something uh, very useful today very useful for your upliftment uh, very needed uh, practice or uh, needed in depth study of any art that you are doing be it dance or music so you can uh, recollect all the words of your gurus Uh, how uh, they you uh, they would always tell you your armandi is not enough somehow i don't feel that your hastas are always uh, looking nice or your abhinay i do need to improve or your uh, uh, focus on the flexibility is not just enough so you can remember and start working on that so flexibility and the stamina part i am very sure that 95% of all the artists agree so to get that it's nothing but your uh, health and practice 
So in this time, I would like to insist that you take care of your health also. Because yes. um, we are deprived of sunlight because sometimes we don't go out of our main door. Yeah. And uh, yeah, sitting inside the house, maybe some kind of uh, delusion or some kind of, uh, um, I don't know what comes upon, but uh, to get out of it, so you have to keep reminding yourself, uh, how is my inner health, outer health, physical and mental health, all the health uh, put together and uh, look into yourself and uh, really bring out the best in you. So, yes, ma'am. And um, yes, and yes. Uh, uh, during this pandemic, uh, thing happening all around, and I uh, uh, definitely would say that things are not going to be as same as it was before. So, how do you think an artist uh, must get accustomed to certain changes that is going to happen? Uh, if you can show some, uh, you know, of your opinion on that. It is really scary. As you said, the yes. world is not going to be the same. After yes, this yes. lockdown or this pandemic is over, it's going to be worse. The situation is worse. Even if you feel the normalcy has returned, but there's a kind of sense of fear. Because uh, nobody thought of this kind of situation. I don't think anybody. Maybe we are coming out with some uh, videos of some uh, gurus or some kind of uh, people who would have predicted it. 10 years or 20 years uh, ago. But still, practically, nobody, even the previous day, we never thought that we would get yes. into this situation. So, this no, extent, like, yes. uh, it's come over us so badly. And first thing, we could not believe. We could not really believe that this is happening to us. And uh, most of the times, we thought maybe it's a nightmare. Yeah, no, 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 it's definitely not happening. So now we have slowly, gradually started accepting it. And this fear of going out and with a mask, with sanitizer, and whatnot, to be very clean and to wash your hands and all these things will not go away so soon. Because even after yeah. this, you're always expecting that something else may happen. Yeah, Something yes. much worse can happen. So you're always a little, uh, um, what to say, like, uh, worry. Worry. Okay, worry. And, uh, you're yes. expecting something, yeah, something more worse can happen. Or, uh, but I don't know, like, uh, this is not in relevance only with arts. What I'm trying to say is, even with our performances, so all these uh, years, it's like uh, these days I knew that some organizers are just going to go on booking auditoriums six months or eight months or ten months or even one year ahead. So this was the confidence that we had. Yes, next year at this time we are going to get uh, national artists from there, there, and we are going to have a big festival and all that. This was the real confidence, saying that nothing will go wrong. I will not let anything go wrong. Nothing will stop me. But now, you know that there's something more, a bigger power that says slow down. You will have to slow yes. down. It's not that you just thought and you can go ahead with that. No, you need to really slow down and think before you leave and think before you do something and think of all the alternate possibilities. It's not mm -hmm. that you just thought and it's just going to happen. So when it doesn't happen, how are you going to uh, adjust with that? How are you going to take it? How are you going to deal with the disappointment that it did not happen? So I think our brains will start working in a way that, uh, yes, mm -hmm. if this happens, well and good. And if this does not happen, we have to be ready with a solution mm -hmm. or with an alternative. So this mm -hmm. is kind of uh, really going to be very tough on uh, all the youngsters, elders, and uh, anybody, uh, any of one of us. And uh, we have to really be prepared mentally because uh, the main statement of today is uncertainty. Uncertainty yes. of our future and uh, uncertain of anything. 
so we switch on the tv and we can expect any any sort of news and uh, we can be like you know uh, we can take it uh, saying that yeah no 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 anyway it will just pass it's just a breeze or start uh, getting scared saying that oh my god this is happening and what do we do when we go and all that but yeah let's uh, bring in more peace and let's be good to ourselves good to others and whatever best we can do let's think of doing something nice uh, because uh, finally it's sahana bhav to sahana connect to sahab we can kind of have a it is in our body the mouth is not in sham so it's like uh, we start realizing the importance of relations relations within the family relations within our um family circle the friend circle and wherever within the artists within arts so let's live and let others live and let's make others also happy uh, in turn which gives us to gives us happiness so this is what uh, the maximum we can do thinking of yes. the present situation that we are going in yes ma'am thank you ma'am uh, it was lovely talking to you and uh, it was uh, very nice to know that uh, how an artist feel because experience is something that only an artist can explain that is the uh, beauty of experience and i think uh, a renowned dancer like you experience you know uh, explaining your uh, point of view is uh, really great and a lot of information about that and uh, i would like to thank you to uh, being uh, for being my uh, first guest speaker so uh, <laughs> i'm very happy and um, i would like to thank everybody who joined us and uh, asking uh, being with us uh, for uh, you know uh, being a part of this live conversation so i really thank everybody and thank you ma'am thank you okay. sir dhananjay sir Actually, maya thanks okay <laughs> you're giving us so many things like actually i must say that yeah this kind of live on live to talk uh, to people i don't know how many people have been listening to me or uh, sharing oh, yeah. my thoughts and felt that yes uh, this is true uh, i should thank you for coming up with this idea and uh, i really at this point of uh, time i would like like to really say that you are indeed doing a fantastic job dear mridula mm-hmm. i'm really so proud of you uh, being an artist yourself uh, you love Uh, creating more uh, sites about art, and uh, you are every day you are thinking like, what next? What do I do to give my small contribution to this field? And that's what I really like the most. And uh, through your uh, page, like Music Arts, uh, you have done a lot. And uh, at this time, for all the things that you have done, hearty congratulations. and lots of uh, best wishes for you to do more and more and more let more creativity in your you also come out and help this uh, art field help some of the artists and as you get in more artists share their views and experiences let more artists be uh, benefited by this and i truly am enjoying this i am really uh, feeling very happy to be be a part of this and um, yeah shubha anyway everybody says uh, it's shubha so shubha moha uh, shubha start uh, start uh, shubharamba shubha shubharamba shubha okay so yes. it will look like that uh, i really wish that uh, with this uh, shubharamba you continue to give more such beautiful um, presentations and articles and talks which makes the whole feel more meaningful thank you so much thank you ma'am uh, with your blessings uh, thank you so much and it is really motivating me to do so much and it's a kind of responsibility for me to carry on with this uh, project and i'm very happy ma'am thank you so much <laughs> thank you thank, thank you viewers uh, your gurus or artists or students friends everybody i'm really happy that uh, if you have watched me and if you felt uh, yeah there was some point that was good i'm happy or if you have any feedback or inquiries or you, you would like to message me you feel please feel free, free to do so thank you thank you for watching thank you ma'am 
thank you so much and i thank all the viewers as well once again thank you yes thank you so much everybody i personally thank each one of you for uh, being with us and uh, for uh, being a part of this live conversation and uh, i expect uh, and uh, we are planning to um, uh, get in contact with uh, great artists again uh, again uh, in coming days so i hope there is a lot of encouragement and support from all you guys so thank you very much i personally thank everyone thank you very much and uh, please stay tuned um, we'll be coming up with a conversation with the great artists again thank you all and uh, stay safe uh, stay home stay safe and be very happy with your family thank you